to take your club one step closer to the national stadium and to eventual glory. And the 100th meeting between Rangers and Air United, and it's for a place in the last eight of the Scottish Gas Scottish Cup. That's an important touch to steer it away for Air United after Oscar Cortez advanced well, but this is Jack. Now Barisic. Nico Raska, early pressure being applied by Rangers. Barisic again, and Cortez, the Colombian, cuts in on his right, gets that curling, and it comes off the outside of the post from Oscar Cortez from Rangers. Cortez has showed real energy to not just have shots on a goal, but to win the ball back. I mean, he's done really well so far, but, I mean, real good effort, cuts inside that. Cortez, Jack again. Mandy goes searching for it, good feet from Cortez, he's going to try and hit that corner again, rifled in with power and Robbie Much in the end holds on. Wants to come inside the pitch, who wants to link up the play, one-twos move, it allows you that space and opportunity to deliver dangerous balls into the box. Right to Cortez, the two wingers combining down the left-hand side, Cortez across, McGinty did really well, and now the shot comes in and deflected for the goal! And Borna Barisic gets Rangers ahead, the early goal that they were looking for. The ball back is good connection from Borna Barisic, he tries to get on target. I think it just takes a little nick. I mean, you're tired as it is, you're looking forward to, to half-time eh, so you can regroup. You don't want to be giving away sloppy passes for no reason. Silva to Tavernier, good stretch from Reading to make sure that one didn't make its way through. No, it was a fair point Alan makes, you know, it's commendable that they're looking to play out but there's just decision making in terms of when and when you're five minutes before, in, uh, before half time, just box clever. Cortez on the left, oh it somehow goes all the way through. Tavernier. 90 seconds to go in the half. Tavernier, now out to right, head down and for the byline, and coming in is Barisic, another deflection, but this time it's much who saves. Scott Wright, fancying a run into the box, slams it across Diamande, Stanger and then Cortez. What Tavernier saying, could anybody be getting in at that back post area? You see that one there where moment in time they're moving the ball really well and finding good space, but it's just the, the, the final touch was letting them down at this moment. Raska, Barisic, Rangers knocking heavily at the door. Tavernier and goes all the way across. Well, now right. It's one on one with Reading, but looks to go infield to Tavernier. Cantwell again takes it on the turn. Nice little feint, and then the chip that will be surely turned in. Silver! The silver lining for Rangers as Fabio Silva gets that crucial second goal that they have been looking for since the opening 10 minutes. Obviously finish, I think this is a real good pass. What a turn from Cantwell, just taking on the half turn, just taking it away from McGinty. It's a delightful ball. You see here, Ravi Matondo as he's coming in, as it touched that hand. It's very difficult to tell there. Well, the goal has been given, the decision. Let's see if they can add another one. Yilmaz, Goldson went for it, it's now Scott Wright, releases the shot and Suter is in there, got there ahead of the goalkeeper. 
and it's a big slice that comes from McGinty and then Dowds in the corner to follow. So no upset here at Ibrox Rangers. Heading through to round six of the Scottish Gas Scottish Cup. Scott Brown's return.